This is uh, one of my apiary sites where the uh, honey has uh, been coming in in dribs and drabs and the honey production hives are nearly full. The nukes have got about uh, three frames on each particular nuke and the triple nuke there, that, that particular nuke, the triple one, has uh, got about one and a half, at least one and a half supers of uh, honey on board. Here I'm checking some more uh, hives to see how they're going. There's another couple of uh, honey production hives. These particular hives are nearly full and uh, it's the end of May. So they won't have to uh, be uh, fed any or change any, any honey supers around. This is the gap filler that I've used. It's also uh, fantastic for uh, filling in gaps before you paint your supers. This particular nuke uh, has got a crack in the in the join. It's uh, nearly 30 years old and due for retirement, but uh, I'll see if I can get uh, this particular winter out of it. After a number of years of use, the supers or bases or any gear can get uh, cracks in them and uh, they can uh, house ants. Also, when any timber starts to rot, ants can make a home in them and uh, that, that can be a real, real problem. As long as any hive is strong in bee numbers, the ants don't seem to worry them. But if the hive is weak, the bees can be driven out and uh, you'll find that they'll have to make a new home. Uh, they will not come back. This, this will mix them up and mix the, uh, the ants up. After the uh, gap sealer is uh, placed on the uh, base, it seals the ants inside and uh, hopefully it'll kill them. It's just about time this base here is ready for a new one. There's another one over here it's, it, uh, it's just about ready for the retirement. That sure has woken the ants up. This uh, super may just uh, see the winter out. After the uh, no more gaps is put in any particular area on your supers you can wipe it down with your finger to smooth it off or you can use a uh, a wet rags which will, which will do the same thing. Just looks like it's been painted. All the nukes uh, seem to be working uh, really well. No uh, chalk brew disease, thank goodness. Not a lot in this particular one. But uh, if we knock on the It'll wake them up. Soon start coming out. They're keeping that uh, brood warm inside. With the uh, tech uh, brood rearing mats. The bees are active today. It's good to see them uh, back from holidays. As the holiday has been uh, well over 12 months now. Please like, subscribe and click the bell to my channel to help it grow. Thanks for watching.